Welcome to this new video cast about MySQL. Today we're going to see MySQL X Dev API and how to deal with JSON. If you remember correctly, in the previous video we create a, a doc store with a restaurants imported from Mongo, right? So this is the first one. So today we're going to make an app in Python that display a JSON. There is a query and the result is a JSON. So let's have a look to this app. Nothing very special here. We use MySQLX and we import it. As you can see here, it, I find the first one and then I display the JSON and I return JSON, right? Because my app only returns JSON. So now if I want to find the best restaurant of each type of food and show only the top 10 with the best one first, this is very complicated to do in NoSQL, in CRUD operation. So for that, it's almost impossible to do. What I will do, it's that in my session, so exactly the same session, I will this time do an SQL statement because sometimes SQL is needed. And this is one very uh, nice case where SQL is needed. So let's do SQL to um, go through all this JSON document. And I want to return JSON because also my uh, application only consumes JSONs, right? I don't want to have fields uh, in columns and records. I just want a big JSON with all my result. So to do the query, I need to use a common table expression. I also need to use a window function. And I use also the a JSON table to be able uh, to do my window function on all the grades inside of an attribute in JSON. So this is how I will write the SQL, right? So I'm using the rank. I will partition all that on the type of cuisine and I will order by the score. And I will limit all that by 10. Of course, as I use JSON array aggregate for a JSON object, all the JSON documents will be encapsulate in one big so I need to use to fetch only one result and display it because it contains all the JSON I want. So let's run my app, go back in my application, refresh and here is it all the JSON documents. Don't forget this was only JSON documents not tables not relational tables and I have my result. So thank you very much and see you next time. Bye-bye.